Maurice Mo Cheeks was seldom the flashiest player on the court, but his steady, all-around game proved invaluable to the teammates and coaches who appreciate team play and defense the most. A consummate professional, Cheeks always put the team first, evidenced by the fact that he led his team in assists all four years of high school and later in college at West Texas State. Cheeks was selected with the 36th pick in the second round of the 1978 NBA draft by the Philadelphia 76ers. He had his best seasons with the 76ers. At the young age of 22 he gained a notable role on the 76ers, solidifying himself as the starting point guard and earning himself valuable minutes. The 76ers were also in playoff contention for every year that he was on the team, except for the 1987-1988 season. By his fifth year in the league, he was selected to his first All-Star appearance and had averaged 12.5 points, 6.9 assists, and 2.3 steals for the 1982-1983 season. The 76ers also had the best season in this era, having a 65-17 record which is the second best season record in the 76ers franchise history. They would go on to win the NBA championship that year, which was Cheek's first and only championship. He would be an integral part of the 76ers for the rest of his time in Philadelphia, however the 76ers failed to repeat the level of success that they reached in the 1982-1983 season. He would be selected to three more All-Star appearances from 1986 to 1988. In the 1986 playoffs he averaged a playoff career-high 20.8 points throughout the whole postseason. In the 1986-87 season he would average a career-high 15.6 points in what was considered the best season of his career. However the Sixers were no longer elite title contenders and lost in the first round in the 1987 playoffs. The following year they missed the playoffs in what was Cheek's last all-star appearance. Cheeks played one more season for the Sixers, they were back in the playoffs but got swept in the first round by the New York Knicks. He was a prototypical point guard, making life miserable for the opponent on one end and working tirelessly to set up his teammates on the other. The four-time NBA All-Star finished his career as the league's all-time leader in steals and ranked fifth in assists, all while shooting better than 52% from the floor. A fan favorite in the city of brotherly love, the unselfish guard was honored as one of only seven former Sixers players to have his number retired.